Hey YouTube, I just had a local contractor drop some stuff off for me. Tote full of some old sheet. It's got some nails in it. There's a stereo down in there. Christmas lights. Some other lights there. Big speaker. Don't show sure what I'm going to do with that, but that's okay. Nice wire. Some more speakers. Some more wire. That's just got down in there. A uh, piece of ridge cap. Not sure if that's aluminum or metal. It's light, but. And. My Canadian friends will know that, explore that. That's an extrude aluminum on the back. That's what they have on top of the houses for internet access. And also, they got an old uh, air conditioner that's tore half apart, so. Pretty good. So do you guys uh, also just an off note here do you guys uh, sort out your cans that you use for canned vegetables and stuff? I do. Take these in a shred and the cat food ones are in aluminum so I'll put those in my old sheet. We're getting to the spot where the snow's leaving and you can see my mess. Oh, I'll show you another tote that the contractor gave to me. It's pretty cool. He said that as he works on houses and takes electrical apart and wires apart, he's just gonna put them in and put that all in a tote and and uh, send it my way, which is awesome. Local guy that I've known for quite a while. So here's the other tote that I put inside. Nice copper. Some brass bits on them. Some more brass, more copper, some nice wire down there. It looks like that one got a little melted, so that'll just go in low grade. More copper and brass down in there. Yeah, so. No, it was melting a little bit. You can start seeing things. That's good and bad. Good that the snow is melting, and bad that you can start seeing things. Cause it's... And then, because I'll show you my behind my garage my back lawn this stuff here there's shred i think there's some stainless steel here some old sheet i gotta sort this stuff out and really get at that the mowers i'm going to take the engines off and throw out the uh, decks maybe I might throw a couple decks on Marketplace just to see if there's any interest in anybody buying them. But yeah, still got some bikes. So I've never bought my kids bikes. I always find them along the road for garbage day and take two or three bikes and make one for them. And this used to be full of scrap. I finally got, was able to get rid of most of that. But yeah, there's engines, TVs, there's 
most everything around here. So yeah, that's what's going on. Snow is leaving. So hopefully in another week or two, I can have a trailer here and fill that full of shred. Oh, and there's a hospital light here that I gotta take apart too that I got out of the veterinarian office. So that'll be pretty cool to take apart and see. I think there's a lot of medical grade uh, aluminum and stainless on that. So anyway, no, I just wanted to show you my uh, drop off that I had today. Starting to get people dropping it off and I think I've got a, another cell phone company or at least two in town that are going to start saving their e-waste for me and then they'll just email me or um, text me let's turn this around see if i can turn this there hello youtube so yeah we'll have to uh get some more Look at that big ball that's in the sky. Wow, I haven't seen that for a long time. It's so warm and nice. But anyway, hope everybody's having a great Thursday. And uh, we will see you on the next one. And everybody get out there and get scrapping. Uh, ask your schools, your hospital maintenance whatever if what they do with their e or waste you might be surprised the worst they could say is no when you ask them if you could have their e-waste that's the way i look at it but anyway remember to like subscribe share and oh the sun 16 17 degrees today and i'm in my t-shirt it's awesome it's great Talk to you guys next time.